the hype. There's nothing this is going to show me that's going to make me somehow more hype. But sure, fuck it. We can watch it. Things are prime. Kim, Kim Spur and Dylan. Elden Ring is an action RPG set in a dark oh, fantasy oh, world. It's a cool design. <laughs> that was Enter silly the lands looking. Between. A place of it's not a YouTube scale, day. It's tournament day, but mystery. I'm going to check out the Where new trailer. Your journey to reveal the fabled Elden Ring unfolds. Hey, Space. Thou shouldst take the crown. The lands between is ruled by great heroes. Those who have inherited yeah, I know the Asmund's of playing right now. Someone He's a prime chance. Extinguish thy flame. Thanks to give some Dylan bits fluff and resub axe. You play bits as magnet. a descendant of the tarnished. A group of heroes once banished from the lands between. When the Elden Ring was shattered, the very source of the Erd Tree's This game went was like fucking four years without a peep. Tarnished, and over the last four months, they've got like 20 hours worth of trailers. I offer you an accord. As a tarnished, you'll set off on a journey to the lands between, rich with mystery. Is a bit drizzle and give some face. To face the former heroes of this world. Lands between. Do you think they've shown too much? I don't think there's a such thing as showing too much. Teeming with threats. But I'm just already not a big trailer guy. You'll face many fearsome enemies. Meet a wide variety of characters. But this is a good trailer. Dungeons. Those who brave showing a lot of content. Mines and caves will find themselves adequately rewarded. Travel far enough, and you'll eventually reach your legacy dungeon. Carbonated and tombstone. A complex and probably won't do the crash twin sanity speedrun. That connects seamlessly with the surrounding landscape. These sprawling environments offer their own style of tension and exploration, creating a different feel from that of your journey through the overworld. Thanks a bit, Oscar. How long is the trailer? Six the minutes. between are vast. And it's a full a gameplay trailer. For explorers. Use the map to assist with navigation. Place beacons and markers for places that catch your eye. Or fast travel to previously discovered checkpoints. Wow. For faster travel. I mean, this is like a real open torrent, world game. Trust the spectral steep at any time, anywhere outside of dungeon areas. Torrent offers excellent mobility making it possible to venture further and higher into the lands between. Throughout your journey, you'll meet with many characters, each with their own motives and goals. Red. I this am the Lord. Power. All that is golden. Help them pursue these goals, to reveal their backstories, and learn of your shared place in this <laughs> world. Was that one of the monkeys from Sekiro? Mm, I don't think so, but it does kind of look like it. When you go into the monkey dream, or the monkey dimension. Learn of your shared place in this world. Thank you, tier one, Rory. Player freedom extends infamous. far beyond exploring the lands between. Your character can be fully customized, from appearance to armor and ability. Become a warrior, specializing in close quarters combat. A caster that excels at sorcery or incantations. Or of course, bit you could attempt to master a little of everything. An extensive lineup of equipment, weapons, magic, and skills are waiting to be discovered, allowing you to develop your character in whatever way you wish.
I mean, it definitely King looks good. Ventra may find item crafting useful using materials picked up along the way. No. Oh, Many different items I hate can be crafted that. on the fly, from arrows and firebombs to cure. I'm just never a fan of just having to fucking tediously loot everything. Call upon spirits to fight alongside them. It's super easy. Well, it's, it's nothing hard about looting, it's just tedious. So summoning them according to the situation is key. In particularly dangerous situations, you may choose not to engage the enemy, using stealth to outflank or escape. Of Jeff. You can also join with players from other worlds. The bit vanilla. To journey, explore, and challenge tenacious foes together. The expansive world of the lands between is abound with. Wait, I forgot you played the uh, mythological network quest, thinking. In your adventure and reveal its secrets for yourself. Rise, tarnished. Rise and become the Elden Lord. God damn. Yeah, I mean, it looks like it's gonna be another banger from FromSoft. They haven't missed yet. I don't think they're gonna start with this one. You can really see that George R.R. R. Martin influence there. What the fuck did he do for this game again? Just like, say he likes it at some point or something? Why was George R. R. Martin's name at any point ever attached to this?